Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West where I just realized it's kind of odd that they're calling them bristle bags because I don't think they're especially bristly backed but they are very because bristle mm. bags are everywhere oh my gosh <laughs> they are very boar like because I think they're they're based off of wild boars this one's like leading me somewhere I also want to see some more of the new machines. Hmm? I swear I hear flying machines. Am I gonna... Am I gonna bite my butt? Bite my butt. <laughs> bite my tongue. Bite my... <laughs> I'm gonna get it. I think I was trying to say, am I gonna get bit in the butt? Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Am I gonna get bit in the butt for, like, immediate karma for, like, I want to see new machines, and then I get accosted by, um, a winged one. But, you know, I would probably get bit on the butt, too. Sounds like someone's putting up a fight. It's just a couple scroungers. This is him and his element. <laughs> Just a hammer. Just the fight. Aloy? Errand. I don't think he would survive that. That hit. I'm sorry, I distracted you, Errand. To be fair, that was really smart of him to get out of the way instead of like trying to show off or whatever and being a being a silly head. This is taking forever. Um those bristlebacks have acid canisters on their backs. Um, it should trigger a chain reaction if I hit them with acid. Oh, is that I thought that mm. Well I was gonna... How do I, how do I do this one again? Nope, not that one. This one. Aim with L2 and fire with R1. Okay. Come on, don't they have like a trail I can... Interesting. That's they're like they're going like in a weird spot. Hmm. What? It can't just... I was like, it can't just detonate on its own. Alright, next idea. Come on. Oh, I don't have enough to craft more. Cool. That's really cool. No, that's really cool. I kind of want to go. Yes, I want to go over here. 
Beans. Uh, oh no! <laughs> Who else is here? <laughs> oh, that one hurt. Don't mind me. Like hammer to metal. Smash the good. Trying to activate the critical kill sometimes is annoying. Oh hey, there's another. Okay. One second. One second, Eric. Hey, Lloyd. Uh, you know, you might, you might have to <laughs> meet me halfway. Here. <laughs> God. Oh, he is injured. Oh, oh I forgot he's injured. Uh, <laughs> caught me at my best. As usual. Well, you did the hard part. I just took care of the stragglers. How bad is it? Uh, this? Ah, who needs to <laughs> oh. oh, I'm good. I'm good. Huh. Okay, well, I, I know you didn't come all the way to the Daunt just to watch me get wrecked. So what's the story? I need the embassy to happen. So I can head west. And what I did at the Spire, what we did, it didn't end the threat. It just slowed it down. There's still more to do. Really? Well, well that's great. I, I mean, yeah, not the threat's not over part. That's not. So mm -hmm. but, but hey, what? Whatever you're up against, your spear, my hammer, just like old times. Oh. oh. But the ribs. Aaron, I need the embassy now. I can't wait for you to heal. Couple of days rest, if that. Actually, even if you oh, no. Hurt, what I have to do, it's it's better if I. She's do trying it. to alienate everyone. She's being mean. Alone. <laughs> oh, that figures. Aaron, I hate to interrupt the romance, but I'm pretty banged up here. Don't blow your blaze, I'm coming. They're both injured. Oh, this just keeps getting better. Huh. Listen. I'll go to Baron Light, get patched up. If you want this embassy to happen, we're gonna need this sun priest. Studious Wadis. Oh, I know him. I'll clear the Valley of Bristlebacks, then send Wadis to Baron Light. I'll catch up with you there. Well, I guess that's sort of like a goodbye. Mm. I'm sorry? You? Sorry? <laughs> oh. yeah, that'd be a first. Where is this coming from? Hey, just, you know, forget it, yeah. Oh. It's nothing. It sounds like something. People are trying to be friends with you. All right, fine. And you're not letting them. <laughs> no, after the battle at the Spire, you, you took off. You left without so much as a handshake. I mean, people like me, we fought and bled at your side, Aloy. You just, or you just disappear? What kind of person does that? Um, oh, uh, I'm at, oh. <sighs> I mean, I did have a good reason. I did actually have another choice, but I'm, God, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm a softie. I gotta do that. Aaron. I'm sorry it wasn't easy for you when I left. And I know it's not easy now, but... What I've been doing... 
Life on Earth is in danger. And only I can save it. Life on Earth? Yeah. Everything dies unless I succeed. Well, then let me help. You can't. There's no machine to fight, no bad guy to kill. What I've got to do, I... I can't even explain it. Not even to people I care about. Oh, so much for being useful. Okay. Aaron! By the forge. I guess that's my cue. Maybe I should go with you to Baron Light. No, no, hey, you're needed elsewhere. Obviously. We'll make it without you. <laughs> Come on, oh my god. <laughs> oh. I think I've cleared out most of the puzzle oh, bags. very sad. Shane's scraping it back to work now. <laughs> I'll go give Olvent the good news. What he's to. Man. Then maybe this embassy can finally oh, happen. Man. I'm just look at me alienating everyone. Oh, I'm unhappy. Can I? I can't even. I can't even craft anything from here. I have to run all the way back. Oh. Well, let's see if I can craft camp things from from workbenches. I'm distracted. I almost killed that blue jay. I did actually when I was playing the for the Frozen Wilds DLC earlier today. I killed an owl. And I was like, I don't think you can shoot birds. Like flying birds in Horizon Zero Dawn. But I have a feeling you oh jeez. I have a feeling you might be able to. But I don't do that very often. <laughs> if, if at all, if it, if it is even allowable, but it was cool. I think I killed an owl though, which made me feel bad. I know that like it's the very beginning of the game and we, we get back along with people again, but it's still frustrating. Like, I get what Aloy's doing, right? Like, and I think she doesn't want to put in. It's not just that she won't, won't want to put anybody at risk. Like, truly, like, this kind of thing is, like, it's big. Like, it's bigger than most people would be able to at least comprehend without, like, having a really hard time and needing to be walked through it. Like, your whole worldview would shift with, like, the stuff that's revealed with what she does. So, like, she's kind of trying to protect people from that, but I also think she's getting a little bit of a savior complex, like, subconsciously. Like, she thinks that she's the only one who can handle this, and, like, sure, there's a lot of things that only she can do, but... Time to get Elvin to blow the whistle, then what is to be But, you can always use help with anything that you're doing, you know, even if you can't explain it all the way... You know, these people trust her, they would, they would help her even if she couldn't explain everything, you know, so... But she's gonna learn that. Still here, I see. <laughs> what was that voice? Still here, I see. I cleared out all the bristlebacks. Oh, you did? Oh, yes. Now that you've recovered from your shock, time to blow the whistle. Oh, there, not so fast. <laughs> I'll have to send someone out to confirm the kills. Make sure the valley is safe again. It shouldn't take more than a day or two. No. You blow the whistle now. These are innocent Osram lives we're talking about here. Surely the delay... Either you do it now, or I will. Ah, I knew you could do it! Friends, gather mm. around. The savior of Meridian has done now it again. What? The bristlebacks are defeated! Uh, you. What? Sound the whistle. Chain scrape is open for business! Yay. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> and Olvind has agreed to personally pay every worker their lost wages. Yeah. That's where I like it. Yeah. Woo. Aha. Yeah. Still pretty yeah. soon. Don't you have an embassy today? <laughs> yeah. I guess I do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, merchant's nice. Okay. Wow, okay, maybe I don't go. I go shopping first now that the. Yeah, the chain scrapes back to work. Mm -hmm. Merchants should be open to trade. 
I should see if they have anything upgrading useful. my gear. Nice. Off to bear light. Uh, where, where's the stupid workbench? Stupid workbench. Are we okay, game? Oh, a J. I do need to kill the Jays then. Okay. I want to know what the other upgrades would do. It just increases weapon stats. I don't. I don't care. I really don't. I really don't care. Oh my gosh! I have to unlock all three to get. The, sl the weave slots and all. How do I make a freaking... How do I make... Fast travel things. What a nightmare! Oh, all of- oh, perfect, they've or- Oh, I just realized- I, I didn't really realize the way it was organized. Good golly, it's finally organized in such a way that like all my valuables are up top. This is so nice. And I don't have to worry about selling the wrong things if I don't want to. I could do the herb list. I'm not too worried about that. Don't care about that. Oh, I forgot we had him down here. Like, I mean, I know he came down with us, but for some reason I thought he was elsewhere. Have you just been hanging out up here? I should have maybe looked for him. <laughs> the way to Baron Light is clear. Get moving. You're not Aaron Vanguardsman. I will move only when the captain when said. I cleared out all the bristlebacks. Which I have. Captain's orders. So they're okay? Banged up, but breathing. And waiting up ahead for you. But, but I, I was supposed to have three mm, escorts. Well. I'm off to Baron Light Buddies. Like Aloy said, Captain's orders. You can stay here. Abandoned to the riffraff? I think not. Guess you're coming with me then. See you there, Aloy. Poor guy got left behind. Holy cow, he's gonna carry that whole thing? Oh my gosh, how much stuff do you need? Little pudgy orange man. What? <laughs> it's gonna be slow going. You shouldn't have brought so much. Unless that's all the Vanguard stuff too, which would be fair. Well, now that that's done... The embassy can finally get underway. If I can get through it, I'll be able to track down Silence. Hades. <sighs> Maybe even a guy at backup. Guess I could head straight for Baron Light. Or poke around Oh, ride a charger. First. Do I need to like ride a charger in? Is that gonna be like really impressive or something? Oh my gosh, there's more. Oh, I need to talk to Petra. I need to talk to Petra first. Before I leave. What else? Oh shoot, Aaron's here now. What else do I want? What? A 
acid fire. I don't know. I don't know what I'm looking for. <laughs> what am I doing? Oh, I checked uh, online. And apparently, in order to make fast travel packs, I have to do it like this. So I'm not just trapped in the wild. Not that this flaming slag keep oh, got its ten travel packs? Charms, I thought it was five. The best oh well. Beer to be found outside the claim for one. The, uh, oh, I wanted to look. That's right. I wanted to look and see what the exclamation point or the asterisk meant. Card trip. Okay, now I need to look. How to wear face paint. This game doesn't explain some things, unless I just totally missed it, which is totally possible. Oh, okay. Players will need to pay a painter to apply a face paint pattern after unlocking it. So you can apply it in photo mode, but it will go away until you can have a painter paint your face. Okay, that's fair. Skills, that's what I wanted to get. What does this one do? Oh yeah. Health recovered per hit. That's sick. Oh, I can upgrade the skill from here. Okay, nice, 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 nice. That is pretty sick. I wonder if I do it. When I do it, I put the face paint on. Oh, jeez. Hmm, <laughs> okay. Bouncing bomb? What? What? We use up to two bombs of your currently selected type. Shredder gone. I don't have that yet. What? What? <laughs> That's sick. Hold up, hold up. Let's see if we can see any more secrets. Activate a cloaking device based on stalker technology. Aiming a weapon or using melee attacks. Aiming a weapon, that sucks. It would be very cool if you could aim the weapon at least. Smoke bomb. I would like to have more smoke bombs. Moving quietly, really nice. For warrior bows. Oh, a combo. Oh, I see. To energize your target, finally switch to a bow and shoot the energy on the target to deal a massive. Holy! What? Some of these combos are gonna be sick! Holy cow! Could I do that now? Deal more damage for strike an enemy with melee attack to build up energy in your spear than when fully charged. Tap R2 to energize your target. Finally switch to a bow and shoot target up. Yes, I recognize that. Oh, I see. I can do that. Okay, wait. I can do that right now. This is just this upgraded though okay maybe i should learn the first skill on each tree one fully charged this is cool i'm watching the okay wow that's really cool Let's get... Okay. I'm not too worried about the machine stuff. Oh, that's cool. That's actually really nice. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to see these new machines. 
bike thrower. But I don't I don't have that yet. Give me new toys. Give me give me my old toys rather. I want my old toys back. Hey, let me also check and see what the Ah, uh, yeah, okay, so it looks like green weapons get three upgrades, blue gets four, purple and legendary weapons have five upgrades possible. So I'm not upgrading the weapon to make it blue or purple. It's just literally upgrading the green weapon, which I don't want to do. I want to save up money and I want to get the sick weapons. So it really does just like beef up the power, which to be fair would be nice. I'm not, I don't do a ton of damage right now. But I want to buy cool stuff. I just, I don't want to like do anything too hasty in the early, early game. Like I want to, want to save up some stuff. Oh, wait, I need to, well, I need to talk to Petra. Um, I want to save up and like be able to access the higher level weaponry earlier in the game. Mm -hmm. Yes. Something else? How come he's working in here? And not... I need to go. Of not course. in like an office. Hey Loy. Back for more, huh? Strike. Another round here? Heard you've been busy. As for me... I'm gonna need a few more of these before I get back to the forge. Is there something on your mind? Well, things aren't as bad since you got this place running again. But we still got Olven grading the gears about his concession decree. If you don't put that down, I'll come over there and show you how that game ends. <laughs> anyway, right now, I'm just worried about those refugees out from Sunfall. To come all this way and during forge. That's those what? people. How I saw. They won't let anyone up the old trailhead southwest of here. And therein lies the problem. A stormbird crashed up on the cliffs last week, and Tallinn Clean Brokers had his eye on the salvage ever since. But the refugees have barred entrance. Mustn't interrupt their sun-scorched ritual. Something about finding a twilight path. Huh. Never heard them talk about that before. Yeah, well, these particular Shadow, Shadow Carja are an odd Shadow bunch. Carter. But overall, they're peaceful folk. Not that it matters to Tallinn. He'll crack some heads to get to that salvage. Maybe you could swing by, convince him to set up camp somewhere else? What else can you tell me about the Shadow Carja refugees? Well, they don't call themselves Shadow Carja for okay. one. At least, not anymore. They're some other brand of sun craze. This is their land. But whatever side of the sun they're on, they're peaceful through and through. Don't seem to want for nothing except a place to live, pray, and just enough food to keep from starving. So they're just camped outside by a trail, blocking entry to a wrecked stormbird, waiting for what exactly? Don't rightly know, but I'll tell you this. Should they ever wise up and salvage it, a stormbird heart is worth a lot. And if they get there first, then by Ostrom Law, it's theirs. Not that Tolan Clean Brokers ever lost sleep over any law breaking. It's also Carja land, <laughs> so it's Carja rules. Who is this Tolland Clean Broker? Just some chuff huffing pawnsman. Mm. Got a shop here in town. Lived in chain scrape since there was a chain scrape. He and Alvin go back a ways. Oh no. With a pair of coals and a campfire. Oh, scumbags. Two. So Tolland works for Alvin? Ha! <laughs> Alvin might think so. But Tolland scrapes up his own scams. And he ain't the type to let a few refugees get between him and Stormbird salvage. Well, if I'm up that way, I'll talk to the refugees. Try to convince them to move. Much appreciated. They have it rough. Don't need Tallinn making it rougher. Well, I'm not. I just said Tallinn has a shop here in I'm Chinese not group. going to. I could have a word with him first. I'm, I'm not going to the embassy. I got it. I got to do this because they're on the way, and I was there, and I'm curious what they were doing over there. Drinks later. 
tavern still lively. I'm gonna beat that guy up someday, just you wait. Nope, don't care about that. Don't care about that. I want to... No, no I don't. That's you. The machine hunter that bailed out the cars. Are, are we never heard it put that way? <laughs> what do you want? Heard you've been hassling refugees up by the cliffs. Yeah, well, you heard wrong. There's salvage up there. A storm bird. Nailed him myself with a harpoon here in town. Not an easy shot if I do say so myself. Petra said it crashed. It clipped its wing. And it crashed into the old tower up there. Killed it quick. So if anyone's hassling anyone, it's the shadow cars of filth that's blocking the way up to my claim. And you're ready to crack some skulls to get to it? No need. It's a raggedy bunch. Probably all starved before I have to lift a finger. We'll see about that. Oh yeah, we will. Mm. We? Now shops close to cars of lovers. On your blasted way. It's interesting, people's different, like... Because, like, the Karja couldn't have succeeded without Osram help, right? Like, well, particularly, um, Avad couldn't have succeeded, succeeded without Karja help. And so they're supposed to be, like, really tied, like, closely together. Through, like, treaty and, you know, help and all that stuff. Like, because they work together. But, uh, there's still a lot of Osram that, that don't feel kindly towards Karja. And there's Karja who don't like the Osram. They don't like anybody, though, to be fair. Karja, the Karja can be kind of snobby. So. But, it's interesting. And I was wondering, like, I was seeing some people's reactions, wondering if me, they think I'm going to be, like, allied with the Karja because I helped Meridian out so much. And if that was going to affect things. So that's really cool that it kind of does. I, I'm sorry, I'll be right with you. Uh, okay, I'm not saying it's a bad idea. I'm saying it's overkill. It's a weapon. Kill is the point. Not if it blows the user's arm off. Oh, just, just, just stop talking. Where are we? God. <laughs> <clears throat> so, uh, you, you look like someone who's always searching for a new weapon. Yes. Am I yes. right? Yes. Actually, I... Uh, could you just not... I am with a customer. I, I'm not a customer. I got it. Triple the powder. It'll blow a strider sky high. Ba boom. One shot kill, guarantee. Oh no. Uh, maybe I am. Then you are in the right place at the right time, Red. How would you like to be the, the world's owner first? Of the oh, world's that sounds first dangerous. Machine enhanced, explosive, done in one, machine wrecking, yet perfectly safe. Oh, the javelin. Javelin thrower. <laughs> So basically, I'm gonna be a guinea pig. Are you, are you two from around here? Nah, the claim. Dad sent us out west in search of some unknown opportunity. Said we'll know it when we see it. <laughs> Sounds like you've had other ideas. Let's just say that opening another trading post for my parents isn't how I want to make my mark in this world. <sighs> I imagine traveling alone this <laughs> So, she's your partner? My apprentice. And my sister. She's why we're out here. There was an incident. Another incident. Involving explosives? Ba boom And Dad's precious homebrew. He shipped us out the next day. Huh. Okay. Tell me more about this weapon of yours. I saw a scroll when I was a kid by some Karja scholar who wandered out west. I had a scary drawing of a Tanakh warrior hunting with a kind of javelin thrower. Effective? Yes. Basic? Undoubtedly. But coming out here made me remember it. And I am on the brink of vastly improving the tool's archaic design. Whereas I will perfect it. I can use machine parts to enhance the user's throw, increase the projectile's velocity. Well, Boomer here is adamant that enhancing the projectile is better. Namely with explosive tips. Boomsticks. Why not both? That could work. There's one small snag. I need the parts to make the first working model. What? For starters, I'll need charger horns. Intact. 
Yeah, that. Just be sure to shoot them off before the machine goes Where's down. Where's my tear? Otherwise they my break. My tear blaster. But a real innovation, keep it <gasps> yourself, is a fang horn. I think I have that. There's a mean one east of here. Blow its sky. Maybe off. I don't. Boomer. You get him for me. It's yours. My treat. You have a deal. No, but I want. Where's my cool bow? I'm really sad about the bows. I want my bows back. Give me back my bows. <sighs> um, okay, wait. Uh, I don't have a fang horn rib. Dang. I have something. What do I have? A burrower sound shell and a scrounger spark. I swear I had a rib something. Maybe not. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and call this one here. We're just we're just never leaving. We're just never leaving the starting area. It's just never gonna happen. <laughs> ah. Thank you all so much for joining me. I appreciate it. I am excited to get new weapons, but I really want my old bows back. And I, I'm just recording these all in one day, so maybe somebody said it in the comments already. Or maybe I've already encountered it by the time this this video's gone up. But I'm... I miss fire. And I miss Terror Blast. <laughs> thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. I want to say thank you really quick to my patrons. Uh, specifically to my sapling tier patron, Reese Galito. Thank you so much for your support. And Christopher, my tree tier patron. Thank you so, so much for your support. You're the super bestest, honestly. I really appreciate it. Uh, thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.